Good morning, this is Genevieve O'Keefe, and I am jumping on here to teach about Ningxia Red. So thankful to all of you who are joining me today. I uh, have a, a uh, confession to make. This is my first Zoom class ever. So I have a little bit of technical things that I'm still trying to work on. Um, but I am raring to go with this uh, New Year's resolution to try something new. And I also want to thank all of you who are jumping on here to learn about Ningxia Red in the new year. You know, behavior change, it takes commitment. It's hard. And sometimes um, there are other things vying for our time and attention. And I'm so grateful that you chose to make this a priority today. So yay you and yay me for trying Zoom. And we're gonna work this out together. And i um, so grateful that you're here to join me. All right, so I'm gonna talk a little bit about Ningxia. First of all, if anyone on here can just um, comment in the chat, let me know. If you're seeing everything okay, I'm just gonna type a message here and you can just respond if you get it. All right, so go ahead and respond to that message I sent out. Um, you can respond with an emoji or with words or just a thumbs up and I'll be able to see uh, how that's working for us. Now, I have to tell you that I am doing an abundance challenge this month. Um, and so this is Young Living. We have to start all our classes with an oil, right? So I am choosing abundance oil. Um, this abundance challenge, it's actually challenging us to repeat an affirmation every day to bring abundance into our life. So if you have your abundance oil, go ahead and put it on your hands inhale it remind yourself that you are deserving of health and abundance in all things remind yourself that you deserve to know how to keep yourself healthy and well for many years to come and bring all abundance into your life and your family and your friends okay so we're going to talk about ningxia red today and there's a couple things I want to cover about Ningxia Red. It is, first of all, I want to talk about what is it? Why do we keep talking about this, this crazy supplemental beverage? Second of all, what is it doing in our body? And lastly, how do you economically and efficiently incorporate it into your daily routine? Now, if you have already joined Young Living, you would have received two of these pouches. Of Ningxia Red in your starter kit. If you have not already drank them, go ahead and throw one in your refrigerator so it's nice and chilled as we uh, go through this class and you can treat yourself afterwards. Enjoy your daily dose of Ningxia Red. Um, if you haven't received one of these, it's possible that you purchased a starter kit with um, one of our uh, hidden compartments in the bottom. We say that about some of the older starter kits, they had the oils on the top and the compartment underneath. And believe it or not, some people never found the items that were in those compartments. So check that out. And if you're not a member of Young Living, I'll tell you more about this product and um, you can contact the person that connected you to this, this uh, Zoom class or contact me for more information about how to get your Ningxia Red. Now, what is Ningxia Red? We say it is a supplement. It actually is called an essential oil infused wolfberry supplement. It's right there on the pouch. This is actually a single serving pouch and we can call it a supplement because it contains vitamins and nutrients that are important to supplement our daily diets. Here's the thing, like it doesn't matter how healthy you eat, your body can't always metabolize the vitamins and minerals it needs to metabolize. Sometimes it needs some help. And that's why supplements are so, so important. And I have another class that I do on dietary supplements. And I talk about the fact that the essential oils in the supplement actually helps with the absorption of those nutrients into our body. It's an amazing way that the oils 
and the minerals and the vitamins work together. It's really fascinating. And that's what's happening here in Nature Red. I'm gonna talk about some of the vitamins and minerals that are in this product and you will be shocked at what is in this powerhouse beverage supplement. So vitamin C, vitamin C is huge this time of year. Um, we're in the middle of winter here in Northern Illinois and we hear about vitamin C all the time for its immune boosting benefits. But did you also know that vitamin C is important for building collagen and connective tissues? Those are so important as we age. We've heard more and more about collagen these days and how we really need that in our diet to uh, help us, help our muscles and our ligaments and to just keep us mobile as we get older. A deficiency in vitamin C can result in easy bruising, swollen gums, dry hair and skin, nosebleeds and decreased immunity. So if those are things that you're dealing with, um, it might not just be the weather. It might be that you actually do need to add some vitamin C to your diet. It also contains vitamin B1 and vitamin B3. So we also consider those to be thiamine and niacin. We know niacin is so important and that's uh, why our bread has been enriched with niacin over the years. In fact, the wolfberry, which is the main ingredient in Ningxia Red, contains 100 times the niacin of oat bran and two times that of baker's yeast. And we know that niacin is huge for heart health. Some of the minerals that we find in Ningxia Red are calcium. Calcium is huge for building bones and reducing body fat also and reducing the risk of some cancers. You know, um, when we hear about osteoporosis and the link between osteoporosis and calcium, as far as calcium being a bone builder, uh, one thing people don't realize is that the amount of calcium that you get the first 20 years of your life is actually affecting your bone health towards the end of your life. So it's so important that kids and especially younger women get enough calcium in their diet because that's what your body's gonna use as we age. And magnesium. Magnesium reduces the risk of diabetes and cardiovascular disease. It also treats depression and headaches. And this is crazy, but these dried wolfberries, 100 grams of dried wolfberries contains 325% of the recommended daily allowance of magnesium. So that's huge. Uh, deficiency in magnesium can re result in constipation, migraines, restless leg syndrome, insulin resistance, and it's also beneficial to over 300 enzymatic processes in the body. So enzymes, they're like the starter fluid that goes into our body. They're the things that get, get things moving. They're so important for digestion and hormone balance, and we really need those enzymes in our body, and magnesium is huge for getting those processes started. Potassium. The Ningxia wolfberry has four times the amount of potassium as bananas. We always hear about bananas as being beneficial for potassium. The Ningxia wolfberry actually has four times more. It also contains chromium and zinc, um, which enhances insulin sensitivity and makes it easier for glucose to enter the cell. The wolfberry is 65% of the RDA for chromium, and it also contains zinc, which is very essential for a healthy immune system. It's also a protein powerhouse. We say that because it contains so many amino acids, over 18 amino acids, and the amino acids are the building block of proteins in the body. We need those amino acids in our body. I'll talk a little bit more in this presentation about how blood sugar balance is so important, especially as we age, but we see it even in young children, how when their blood sugar is out of balance, we don't, we don't get the results we want as far as a healthy lifestyle. And so the fact that Ningxia Red actually contains 15% protein by weight, it's amazing for blood sugar balance. Anyone who's struggling with that, um, anybody with diabetes or who's looking to improve circulation, um, or try to deal with obesity or even cravings, so important to include some protein in what you're ingesting. It also contains fiber. Fiber is huge for many, many digestive processes. 
Some other things, iron. Iron can carries, can, carries oxygen to the blood. Uh, deficiency of iron can result in weakness, fatigue, and decreased immunity. So huge, huge vitamins and minerals that we need every day in our body. And they're all in this little pouch, which is a delicious way to get all of those nutrients. Okay, but where does this Ningxia wolfberry come from? Well, let me talk a little bit about Gary Young and the process that he used to find some of these products for Young Living. Gary was an adventurer, he was an explorer, he was a researcher, he traveled around the world trying to find ways to, to find plants that he could bring to his company and make them accessible to everyone. And what Gary found as he was studying different populations and their lifestyles was that uh, people in the Ningxia province of China lived to be 100, more than people in any other population in the world. And he was so curious about this. And he went out to China and he started studying their lifestyle. Like, what are these people doing differently? And he said, well into their 90s, they were still walking up the mountainside. They were physically active. They were participating in their community and the work that needed to be done. They were still actively working well into their 90s. And so many of them were living past 100, well past 100. And he said, what, what's going on here that I can take back to other people? And uh, one thing that he found was that the Ningxia wolfberry was uh, an isolated crop that grew there that was ingested by a lot of people. So he took it back and he studied it. Um, and there's been a lot of information that he collected. Uh, Tufts University has done some studies on the Ningxia wolfberry. And it was found to have the highest ORAC score of any known food. So I'm going to talk a little bit about the ORAC score in antioxidants. Um, and a lot of people don't know this information. So um, I think this is a great time to, to learn it. Uh, the ORAC score is a way to measure the radical absorbance capacity, the free radical absorbance capacity in the body. So that's why we talk about antioxidants so much. We hear about them in our food. We hear about them in our makeup. We want those antioxidants in our cells to help with the cellular processes. Let me give you an example. So we have these oxygen molecules. I'm gonna hold this up. Hopefully you'll be able to see it. Get it over here. Okay, there's an oxygen molecule. Oxygen molecule is O2. These two molecules, they wander around together. They're like a happily married couple. You know, they just, they just always have to be holding hands. They're always together. They can't be separated. They're quite content. They have this bond of electrons that keeps them together, but they have these other electrons that kind of spin around that are not connected to that bond. Well, part of the normal process of our body is that as our metabolism churns, as the cells replicate, some things are thrown off and those electrons are thrown off. Certain electrons can be thrown off. Sorry, I'm adjusting my lighting here. because Suddenly my camera seems to have gotten darker. Okay. Okay, so what happens is they start to lose some electrons and this is a normal process. This, this is kind of like the byproduct of an engine. You know, it's the kind of like the exhaust that comes out of your engine. And we try not to have a lot of exhaust coming out of our engine, but sometimes we do. And um, that's not typically a sign of a good, fully functioning engine. So um, what we wanna do is we want to make sure that our engine is functioning properly. But in the human body, and you have to go back maybe to high school biology to get this, um, and at least I did. I had to go back and think about those cellular processes and the mitochondria and that furnace of the cell that's always working, that's always throwing off the different um, electrons. They're called free radicals. So they, they go off and, and that's perfectly natural. I'll show you on this how the, the free radical kind of spins off, okay, into another cell. The challenge is that without something to bring that free radical back into its proper place in the cell, it can combine with other 
cells and create what's called superoxide. And it's this free radical that, that combines with the other two. I like this picture. It says, you complete, complete me. And you can see how that one oxygen wants to bind with those other two oxygens. And when this happens, it creates unregulated cellular growth. So that superoxide basically is, becomes a scavenger in the body. It takes normal cells and it turns them into unhealthy cells. And that's what's happening in, for example, during cancer. Those cancer cells are replicating and replicating abnormally, and we do not want that. That's why it's so important to have antioxidants in the body. Back to this picture, you can see antioxidants have extra electrons that they can donate to free radicals, and that stabilizes them. That stabilizes them so they don't burn out of control and that they can be emitted as a healthy exhaust. But the thing is, when we talk about antioxidants, we need to understand where they're coming from. And antioxidants come mainly from what we eat. I'm just gonna tell you about some of the foods that are high on the ORAC score. And actually, if you wanna go ahead and make some guesses, feel free to do that. Just jump onto your chat box and tell me what you think some of the highest foods with antioxidants are. Okay, so a lot of people would say, for example, broccoli. We hear about broccoli as a cruciferous vegetable. It's got huge cancer-fighting properties. It's an antioxidant high vegetable. Broccoli contains nine on the ORAC. It's nine on the ORAC score. And the ORAC score is, it's the score that tells us how much antioxidants are in foods. How about spinach? We hear about spinach all the time. Add spinach to your smoothies, spinach supplements. Spinach is 12 on the ORAC score. Kale, I love kale. I eat kale all the time. 18 on the ORAC score. Strawberries, 26. Plums, 28. Blackberries, 51. We're getting up there. Pomegranates, 105. And what about these acai berries? We hear about the acai bowls all the time. 184 on the ORAC score. The Ningxia wolf berry, 303 on the ORAC score. That's huge. That's not even just a little bit higher than some of the foods that we commonly eat. It's a lot higher than any of the other foods. That's why Gary Young wanted us to have the Ningxia wolf berry in our diet. That's why he went to China and he learned how to cultivate the wolf berry crop so that he could bring it to America, so that he could find a way for it to be accessible to everybody. And Gary didn't just find a crop and reproduce it. Gary used the same seed to seal quality standards that he uses for all of his oils. It's grown on soil that has not been tainted with pesticides or fertilizers. It's hand weeded. It's tested with the highest standards possible. Just as he does with all of his other products, he did that with the Ningxia Wolf Berry so that it would be accessible to us. Now I talked a little bit about the antioxidants. I talked about the processes in the body. I talked about how we need our, our furnace, our engine. Let's talk about our engine. Let's call Ningxia Red the fuel for our engine. I love to use this example. Hopefully it's still relevant. I know it's been a while, but these two guys were big hits in my house when my sons were younger. They were their favorite cartoon characters, Lightning McQueen and Tomater. And I love just to use this example because you can see Lightning McQueen, he was fast, he was zippy, he was shiny, he had the best fuel. He said, I am speed, I am speed. 
And Mater was probably a great truck at one time, but now he's kind of old and rusty. His engine hood's falling off. His teeth don't look so good. He's not that fast. And I just want to say, don't be a Mater. Be a McQueen. You can do this. You deserve it. Now, I want to talk a little bit about some of the other foods in, um, and the other things in Nature Red because it does contain some essential oils. It contains or grape, orange, and lemon, and tangerine. And we know that those citrus oils, they contain uh, D-limonene. D-limonene, you can get in your re reference guide or Google that word. And you will find that that is huge for cellular processes. D-limonene, it actually gets to the neuroreceptors of the cells and it cleans them off. So when the DNA in our cells starts to replicate and it's not correct, it starts to replicate incorrectly, that D-limonene goes in there and it says, no, no, erase that message, erase that message. That's not the right message to be sending to your cells. So that our cells can actually start to repair those processes. It's huge and it's in Ningxia Red. In addition, Ningxia Red also contains blueberry juice, plum juice, sweet cherry juice, aronia, and pomegranate. So I read some of those off in our Oric scale. So now you see not only does it have that amazing Ningxia Wolfberry, but it has all the other juices that would be high in antioxidants. And I don't know about you, but there are so many times I go to the store to get a smoothie or some sort of a healthy beverage and it's all apple juice. This is not apple juice. This has all those other juices that are amazing, that are whole fruits that are gonna help our bodies. You know, I talked a little bit about the fact that Ningxia Red is a supplement. And um, we don't realize that as we go through our daily life, we're bombarded with stressors from the outdoor world, from the outside world. I mean, everything from just emotional stress to the germs that are around us. And even if we're eating a healthy diet, we can still have a decreased ability to absorb some of those healthy foods and the nutrients in those healthy foods simply because we've got so much else bombarding us. So I personally use supplements every day. I started taking a supplement when I was pregnant with my first child, and I saw a huge difference in how I felt. So I continued taking supplements, and I love our Young Living supplements. I love the fact that this Ningxia Red can be used by my whole family. It's for any age. We all love it. It's the one supplement we can all enjoy. We can all agree that it's delicious and, and makes a huge difference in our energy level and our ability to fight off whatever stressors are coming at us. Now, I want to talk a little bit about the glycemic index. I just touched briefly on this, and let me see where, where my time is. Okay, so I'm going to keep talking. I do have another class that I teach about sugar and blood sugar and sugar in our diets and how that affects our digestive system because sugar can really mess up our digestion and there's more and more studies coming out um there's a really cool project being done right now called the human genome project and uh, they're actually mapping the cells of the gut and they're finding that there are more cells in our stomachs than in the rest of our body combined. And so many of those cells are healthy bacteria that we need for cellular processes. And when we eat diets that are high in sugars, it actually grows the wrong kind of cells in our guts. And that can be really difficult as our body tries to balance our hormones and tries to control our cravings. And, um, that's a whole nother class, but I do want to touch on the fact that Ningxia Red is so beneficial to um, con controlling the um, blood sugar levels in our body. Uh, because it does have protein by weight of 15%, it is low on the glycemic scale. So if you are looking to cut your sugars, if you're a diabetic, if you're um, trying to lose weight, 
if you're trying to get your hormones into balance, Ningxia Red is a great way to start doing that, especially if you can replace some of the higher glycemic foods with Ningxia Red. Um, you know, Ningxia Red is actually an energy source. Like when we eat healthy foods, when we eat whole fruits and vegetables, and we get those vitamins and minerals, we get energy in our bodies. And I know, I'm, I hope I'm not the only one who's guilty of wanting uh, some chocolate ice cream in the afternoon or a chocolate bar or like needing one of those fruit fruit drinks when I'm really run down. It's so tempting. And when we replace that with something that's a whole food that is gonna give our body energy because it's helping our body create the energy it needs, we can eliminate a lot of those sugary things that are affecting our diet in other ways. In fact, in a 2003 study published in the Lancet Medical Journal, there was convincing evidence that low glycemic foods can actually combat obesity by reducing hunger and cravings. So if your New Year's resolution is to lose weight, then Nixia Red might be the best way to start. I mean, it sure is delicious. So it's a great way to treat yourself in the afternoon while combating some of those sugar cravings. But I do realize that a lot of times we resort to some of the frou-frou coffee beverages and some of the high sugar drinks um, because we are tired. And I'm not gonna say that that caffeine doesn't give us a boost, but for me, I find I get very jittery if I have a lot of caffeine. And when I don't have the caffeine, I can get a really bad headache. Um, and so that's not fun, that really, um, that, that addiction, addictive potential of the caffeine is something that I'm really trying to avoid. I used to drink coffee a lot more when my kids were little because I just needed to keep going. And as I got older and um, had the, the opportunity to try other things instead of the caffeine, I tried to decrease that caffeine. And so I went from the, you know, the chai tea latte at Starbucks to a cup of coffee at home to a cup of tea and now I rarely drink anything with caffeine. And that a big reason why is because of another amazing Ningxia product called Ningxia Nitro. So it comes in this little tube. This is a serving size. It's actually like a little drink. You tear the top off and you just sip it or you can put it in your Ningxia and drink it that way. Ningxia Nitro is a game changer for a lot of people because it has ingredients that support both the body and the mind. It's a great pick-me-up in the afternoon. It's great if you didn't sleep well the night before. It's great if you have to do some long driving. Um, I actually didn't sleep well last night and I got up this morning and I knew I had to do this presentation and I was trying to move around and do stuff and I felt like I was walking through a fog. You ever feel like that where you're just like, I need to move faster, but my body's not doing it. And I, uh, I had a nitro this morning and it just, lifted that fog like I was ready to take on the day and so I would recommend that if you are trying to kick the caffeine habit I would incorporate the Ningxia Nitro and this is actually part of the Ningxia Red Starter Kit so that's a great way to, to try it uh, but let me tell you a little bit about why it does what it does. Uh, Ningxia Nitro contains the same wolfberry blend of strawberry, cherry, bilberry, raspberry, wolfberry, kiwi, and more. It contains essential oils. It contains fatty oils. Sometimes we need those fatty oils for our brain functioning. Did you ever hear that? When, you know, when kids are little, they need that fatty stuff in their brains to help their brains work. It also contains peppermint, spearmint, and nutmeg essential oils. And those are huge for for brain development, for waking us up, for getting our, our cells working. It also contains Korean ginseng, which has been used for centuries to enhance cognition, um, get our mind working. It contains 35 milligrams of naturally occurring caffeine from green tea extract, mulberry leaf extract, and a blend of B vitamins that support cognitive fitness. Um, B vitamins are huge. Like I could do a whole talk on B vitamins and how important they are for our digestive processes and our hormones and everything. And 
really supports our brain development. So that is huge. And it also contains a unique ingredient called bioenergy ribose. So bioenergy ribose, and I'm gonna show you the molecule right here. This is it. If you're a chemistry person, you'll find that interesting. It's a, it's a sugar. It contains a special molecule called ATP. Um, ATP is like the energy currency of the body. Um, every time you breathe in or flex a muscle, it's dependent on the action of ATP. It's like, it's like a rechargeable battery. It's recharged through the nutrients in our diet. And when it's not charged, our body's gonna lack the energy it needs for neurological processes and muscular processes. Um, so basically, because of the structure of ATP here, it can be easily, the bioenergy ribose, which is here, can be easily incorporated into the ATP structure. So it's basically, it's basically helping to recharge that battery, that bioenergy ribose. So that's why you get a natural awakening when you use the Ningxia Nitro. I, I recommend this. I, I don't like to have the jitters at the end of the day because I had a big old cup of coffee and it's just this slow, consistent energy that lasts throughout the day. It's, it's good stuff. Okay, so I've talked about what is the Ningxia, what it does in your body. Now, how do you actually incorporate that into a daily routine? Well, if you are already a member of Young Living, get it on your monthly order. Get it on your essential rewards order. You'll save money on it. Um, there's actually an essential rewards kit that contains four bottles of Ningxia Red and a packet of these, about 30 in a packet. That should last you a month. Uh, I have a family of five and we do the essential rewards box every month with the four bottles and the packets. My kids take these to school and um, we use the bottles at home. It is sufficient for my family of five for a month. If you don't have a family of five, um, you might only need to order it once every two months, but it is by far the best deal. The breakdown cost of one of these, when you purchase through your essential rewards, the essential rewards kit is a dollar and two cents per serving. So that is huge, especially if you're using this to replace some of your other energy drinks. I don't think you could get Gatorade for a dollar and two a serving. And then you have all of those chemical laden uh, food coloring and sugars in that. In addition, if you're trying to get off the coffee kick, if you're somebody like me who like really likes their afternoon chocolate, <laughs> you can kick that habit for a dollar and two cents a day. I know that most Starbucks drinks are not gonna be a dollar and two cents. So that's a great way to get started. I wanna tell you though, my first experience with Ningxia Red was participating in something called the Ningxia Red Challenge. So I will link a copy of the form that I use. It's basically a one month challenge to drink Ningxia Red every day and see the difference. You can log how you feel each day after you drink your Ningxia Red. And it was a huge eye opener for me. And I'll tell you why. Because I thought the Ningxia Red that I got in my starter kit was delicious but I didn't see how it was any better than some of the other things I was already using. I didn't drink it and suddenly feel like I had more energy. I didn't really believe the claims about it. But what I did was I got a box of these little packets and I kept them away from everybody in my family. <laughs> and I said, I'm going to do this challenge and see how I feel at the end of a month. And I will tell you the first nine days, I didn't feel nothing. It didn't affect me at all. It was delicious. I enjoyed having it in the afternoon, but I didn't notice a difference. And it was right there on my chart. Nothing, nothing. 
all of a sudden, the 10th day, I had so much more energy. I like, it was like my body had gotten out some of that stuff that wasn't good for it and had started adapting to having this amazing supplement every day. And after that, I could just see my energy level go up and up and up till the end of the month. And I was shocked at the difference at the end of 30 days. And then I didn't have it on my essential rewards order the next month. And I could feel the difference. And suddenly I didn't have that energy. I went back to where I was without that energy that I enjoyed when I was using the Nature Red. So I would recommend if you are curious, if you're still not convinced, get yourself a box and try the Nature Red challenge for a month. And don't let anyone steal your Nature's because they will, because they're so good. I also really, I just wanna give a side note. I really like to put these in coconut water. Uh, there's two ounces in here and that is usually sufficient for a person every day, but if you are fighting something, um, if you're fighting a chronic illness, if you're fighting immune issues, if you're pregnant, you might find that you need more of those vitamins and minerals. And then you can go up to four ounces a day without affecting your blood sugar still. So, um, but, but two ounces, like if you pour this into a glass, it really only goes up that high. And, you know, I want to sit down for a few minutes and treat myself and enjoy that time that I get to drink my Nanksha. So I have started adding coconut water to it. And coconut water has tons of electrolytes. Um, so especially if you're somebody who's been drinking um, some of those sports beverages, you get the electrolytes. Coconut water is a great way to get those naturally. Just make sure there's no added sugars that it's just 100% coconut water. And I love to add that to my Nanksha to fill up the glass. And then I'll put a couple splashes of lime essential oil or cinnamon bark or orange, just to give it a little bit of, um, just to spritz it up a little bit. So there's tons of really fun recipes that you can do to make your Nanksha uh, even, even more of a special treat. Just a side note there. Okay, so I will go ahead and take questions. Uh, if there are any questions, you can go ahead and ask now. And if there are not, uh, we'll just move on. So I will, I'll just pause for a minute here to make sure I get any questions answered. And just for a show of hands, how many people have tried Ningxia? And um, do you have a comment about it? Delicious. It is delicious. Yes. Yes. You know the difference. You definitely notice the difference when you don't have your Nanksha. I agree. Yes. Great for the whole family. Yes, it is. Yes, it definitely is. Well, I just want to thank you for being here today. Um, you know, it's not easy to try a new thing. I'm so grateful that you're reaching out and curious and looking into options for the new year to be uh, a healthier, more vital, more vibrant you. Uh, I hope this class has blessed you. If you have any questions, if you want to follow me and get more information, uh, I do have a website. It's www.doppledee.com. -E -E and I would love to connect with you online. Um, I hope you have a blessed day. You can do this. Remember, walk in abundance. Be blessed.